Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Renee. In today's video, I will share with you my entire designer shoe collection. I have 10 pairs in total. I don't have a lot because shoes don't hold their value, so I have been slowly investing some in the past few years. I will share with you modeling shots for each of them, what size I got, and where and how I got them at sale price. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel if you found my video helpful. The first pair is the the Dior Jadio sling bag in navy blue velvet. The heel height is 65 mm. They are so easy to walk in. I got size 38 for the pointy toe. They are so elegant. I love the two-tone embroidered Jadio ribbon. It has a leather sole with star which is Christian Dior's lucky symbol. They were made in Italy. Usually shoes don't hold their value so I got them on Fashion File on sale and I saved a couple hundred dollars. And they were in excellent almost brand new condition when I got them. The second pair is the Roger Vivier Belle Vivier Pattern Leather Pumps, which is one of the most classic style of Roger Vivier. They were made in Italy. The heel height is 45 mm. I have two pairs in both size 37 and a half, one in taupe color and one in black color. The retail price is 775, but I got both of them on sale on Southridge. The taupe color was 600 and the black color was 520. 20, and there was no tax because I got it on Selfridges. I couldn't decide which color that I prefer so I just got both of them. I love the square toe and iconic metal buckle on the front. They are so elegant and a square toe can make your feet look slimmer and they are just perfect shoes for a business environment. The leather lining and insole make the shoe more comfortable. If you wanted to see a detailed review, you can check out my previous video and I will link it above. The third pair is my Mononoblanic Hangacy Satin Pumps in blush color in 70mm. They were my wedding shoes, so they were so meaningful to me. My wedding color theme was pink, so I got them in blush color. They were the most beautiful shoes I've ever seen. They are just so beautiful elegant and feminine. I love the buckle which is so sparkly. I got size 38 but it is slightly bigger on me so I got these cushion pads on Amazon. I found them very useful for shoes that are slightly bigger and they can provide more comfort. So I will link it in the information box down below if you need it. The Mononoblanic hangers are not just wedding shoes. You can also wear them on other occasions. But just keep in mind that the set material is so delicate. I only wore them twice. First time for my engagement photo shoot and second time on a wedding day. But the toes already got so dirty and you can also see some peeling on the set material. I got them on sale on sexfifthavenue.com they always have gift card promotions on major holidays so make sure you take advantage of that the fourth one is my Jimmy Choo Glitter Heel which is about 85mm with crystals in the front. I found them on Nostrum Rack which was only about $350 it was such a great deal. You can always find some good deals for designer shoes or designer items in general at Nordstrom Rack. So I would recommend you to check out your local Nordstrom Rack. I wore them on my city hall wedding ceremony and also on a wedding celebration day. They are definitely not the most comfortable heel because of the pointed heel and they were very stiff. But you know, they are so beautiful and the gold glitters were so beautiful and it goes very well with red, black or white dresses. Because of the pointy toe, I should have gotten size 38 but they don't have it so I got 37 and a half. So it does feel a little bit tight. Moving on, I would like to share with you my Hermes shoes. I've talked about them in my previous video. If you're interested to see my entire Hermes collection, you can check out the video that is linked above. The first pair is the Vauvier boot which is this ankle boot in knit material. It hugs your feet so well, makes your feet look very slim. I love the leather details such as the leather logo on the side, the leather straps on the back and it has this horseshoe shaped heel which is 60mm for a very modern and feminine look. 
There are a few heights that you can choose from, but I like the mid heel because it can elevate the whole look, yet still very comfortable. You can wear them with any pants or dress. I got 37 and a half and it fits perfectly. The next one is Royal Loafer in blank calfskin leather with bright yellow interior with a French detail and platinum plated signature H logo. They are the most comfortable shoe that I've found so far at Hermes. I love the chic look because of the calfskin leather so it can get creased very easily but I like the French detail because it can cover the crease. I got size 37 and a half. I would definitely get other colors such as black or brown because they are everyday shoe to wear and they are so easy to style. The third Hermes shoe that I have is the Oasis sandal in white calfskin leather with iconic edge cutout. It has almost two inches heel it goes with everything and i like that it is more elegant and elevates the whole look than the orange sandal i got 37 and a half for them but i think 38 should be a more comfortable size because my feet will be slightly bigger in the summer when it is very hot so for Hermes sandals i would say it's okay to size up half a size the eighth pair is my Tor Birch Mini Ballet Flats in diamond quilted napa leather with iconic metal double T hardware at the front. It has a slip resistant rubber sole, super comfortable foam cushioning, and you can fold them into a dust bag that it comes with so you can pack them in your suitcase or bag, which is so convenient for travel. I got seven and a half. Usually I will get size seven, but I found them a little bit tight in the beginning, so I just went for seven and a half. There was no breaking period. I wear them almost every day in summer. My feet are very flat and wide, but they are the most comfortable heels that I've ever worn. I will get more colors when I see them on sale. Tower Bridge always have sales on major holidays, so make sure you look into that. The last two pairs are my Stuart Wiseman shoe. This is the gold skin suede leather sandal with 3 inch block heel. I love the pro details on the block heel and also on the strap in the front. They are very easy to walk in because of the block heel and ankle strap is adjustable. The pearls make the sandal more elegant. Black just goes with everything. So I've worn them with denim, pants, and dresses. I got them at Woodbury Outlet and it was about $250, which was a really good deal. I got size six and a half. So if you ever go to the outlet, especially the Woodbury Outlet, don't forget to check out the store Wiseman. You can find very good deals over there. Last but not least is my reserve over the knee boot in black suede material with 40mm block heel which gives both style and comfort. So this is a two-tone type of boots. So you have the suede material in the front and the micro stretch material in the back so you can pull it on very easily. It can elongate your legs. The fit is great. Many people said that it's very hard to take the boot off but actually I found it very easy and you can see how I take it off and put it on in the video. For the sizing, Stuart Wiseman usually have narrow, medium, and wide and I got size 7 medium for these boots. StuartWiseman.com has some good deals from time to time. I got mine on DSW.com with 50% off. I will also link some in the information box down below if I find some good deals for you. So these are all my designer shoes. I hope you find my video helpful. Feel free to comment down below or DM me on Instagram if you have any questions. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.